Hey guys, Suzako7 here, and welcome back to my gaming channel. I'm very excited to start my next playthrough. This is a revisit of a game I did almost 12 years ago. And so it's a good thing I actually stop right here because there's going to be a big scene coming up. And this is, of course, Shadow of the Colossus. And this is the remake of the original one that I played back in 2012. And so I'm very excited to see this game fully remade from the ground up. And uh, you notice it was made by Bluepoint that actually I also did another playthrough on my channel, Demon Souls Remake. And so I'm very excited to jump into this one. And so uh, let me know how the volume sounds in here. There's no music right now, but once I get started, there'll be music playing. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so we got performance. I want to keep it on that. Uh, speaker. I guess whatever midnight nah. photo mode frame rate I need performance mode brightness I guess we can turn it up a little bit all right let's do it the game automatically saves your progress all right that's good This game was already very pretty on the original PS2. For this game now to run at 60 frames, and now the quality looks so much better. This is an amazing game. It's not very long. There's no, like, um, normal enemies in this game. They're just, you fight these giant titan colossus. Colossi. Colossus. But, your main, guy, your main character's name is Wanderer, and the horse you're riding is aggro and you got this girl that's actually dead or whatever um it's been a it's been a long time since i played this and the dialogue's definitely the language is different but i am so stoked to play this i mean because my original run was very um it was rough like, I did pretty well. I actually watched back through it. It's just the video quality was rough. It was very hard to see what was going on. But this would be a good opportunity to replay this game again right now. And obviously, I don't want to skip this because this is a very important cutscene. The music's great. The music's so good in this game. I'm going to see how much I can remember this. So what I'm going to do for this stream, I'm going to focus on five colossi. There's 16 in total in the game, by the way. And they're all major boss fights. This game has a lot of, like, Zelda feel to it, in a way. To me, it does. Like, because of how... Because I played Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom last year. But so far, this game looks incredible. I'm glad this game got remade. Very, very long bridge. That's for sure. I think this remake came out, I want to say 2018 or something, 2017, I don't really remember. Well, that's a long bridge, man. So if we go to the shrine, this is like the main area in the game, 
Whenever you defeat a Colossus, well, we'll explain it. There it is, Shadow of the Colossus. All right, let's finally get started. All right, so we got setting. We already did the settings, right? Game, we're gonna keep it. Tutorial, I guess I'll keep that on. Motion blur, I wanna turn this off. I don't want motion blur. Filter. Huh. I'll leave that. Audio. Camera. We're gonna keep it the way it is. Controls. I'll learn as I play. All right, let's do it. Okay, so there's different difficulties. I don't remember this. So I'm going to go... Since I haven't played this game in a long time, let's actually casually play it. Don't expect a crazy run. I'll put it on easy. I've actually never played this game on easy ever before. I played this game on normal difficulty when I originally played it. I know I should keep it on normal, but... I don't think they ever gave you difficulty changes in the original. Maybe the, the Colossus fights will be easier, I guess. But I want to casually play. Don't expect like a crazy run. I'm gonna say there is also these lizards you collect and actually give you more stamina. I'll explain that as I start. There's fruit you also collect too. But this is my first time playing Shadow of the Colossus since 2012. So it's been a very long time. But I needed to play this game again. I had to. Like I did with Paper Mario, I needed to do a, a redeemed run because. My original run of this game was, like, standard definition. It was very hard to see what was going on. And I was recording at the time. This is my first time streaming this game. That's how much I want it to be different. So you guys can get to see me mess up when I fight the Colossus. But now that I put it on easy, maybe it's going to be a lot. Maybe my stamina probably won't go down as much. I don't know. But I never played this game on easy before. Maybe too easy. So here, the, here it is. Those statues that you see. Are the Colossus. <laughs> His face looks a lot better. That's for sure. Okay, so we got this thing here. Looks like something from Majora's Mask, the way it's... So, the dialogue's de very different here. Hmm. Okay, 
was the UAD last also view houses is view. Ikola Rukizado Yulola. Is this was I look? Oh, Miss Quick. You are a lot quicker. That's what these shadows are called, Dormans. It is all of you, Iveriko. It's not all amusement. A little click, if it leads to it. What's the most? It's what you love. Iveriko owns it's what I'm doing. You bet, Sanada.
Look at that. The first one's over there. Oh shit. Oh my god. You two are ready. Jump. Alright, that's how you roll. R1. Okay, that's how you do that. And that's where it is, right over there. Okay, what else can I do? Okay. That's how you crouch. Let's try and... Okay, that's how you call him. Okay, that's how you hit. Oops. Yeah! Oh my god, this looks so good. This feels good, too. Okay, so... Oops. Alright, so over here is the shrine rest area. Right? Wait, it's not. I don't think I could do this yet until after I beat the first Colossus. the map. I have to get used to this. Okay, so fruit is over here. I don't know how to get the... Okay, here we go. pick this up. There we go. It's going to take some time to get used to this. Before the first one, we gotta do some climbing. Here we go. <laughs> Jump and hold our R1. Oh, 
Oh, here we go. Shit. Gotta get used to that. Okay. All right, here's our first one. Wow. Damn, that looks so good. Oh shit. Oh shit. Use the controls again. Alright, I gotta get used to the controls because I failed that first time up. That's the first one, that's very easy to take out. It's just, I'm overwhelmed by how good the graphics are in this. <laughs> it's a lot easier to see everything. Alright, so this is always gonna happen every time you kill a killer. There's, there's no way to outrun this.
What's going on, PJ? Alright, so we're back here. And this is going to happen every single time you defeat a Colossi. So that's one. It's usually very easy. Now, you notice there's one dormant and it will increase the more you actually defeat him and your appearance will change too right now it's not really changed too much So this happens every time you destroy a Colossus. Let me hold, let me know how the audio sounds, PJ, because you're the only one on here right now. Does the music sound good? Do I sound good? Showing us the next one. And this is going to happen a lot through the playthrough. Where it's going to explain, like, oh, you need to go to the next de destination to fight this one. And... Alright. We're going to go down here. I think we can save now. Yes. save all right Agro. all right so the second one here. Yeah. Yeah. It's hard to control that. This looks really good. Oh shit. Yep, we're on the right path. This one's a little tricky because you gotta be on your horse a lot for this one. This one, I'm, I'm probably having like a lot of failed moments here.
So I'm gonna definitely need uh, my bow for this one. Man, this game looks so good. I'm, I cannot believe how good this looks. It's gonna take me a while to really know the controls, because, you know, I'm, it's been a long time since I played this. Alright, let's see where this thing shows up. It's over here, maybe? Oh, yeah, you can get on top of your horse like that. It's over here, yeah. Hit his feet. Get out, let me get out of the horse for a minute. Yeah, they're under there. It's very difficult to hit his feet. It does give you a lot of time. Yeah, you gotta you gotta be on your horse. What the fuck is he? This is gonna take a while. This is gonna take a minute. It's hard to control this shit.
Uh oh. Wow, that almost got me. Damn it. This is gonna take like 30 minutes for me to finally figure this out. You have to hit his feet. But then you gotta jump on him. It's very difficult. Yeah, it's such terrible aim. Okay. What? Oh, come on. You can't really climb on him normally. I'm trying to remember how I did this before. Such a fail. Ah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. God, that took forever. And the music's gonna hit. Okay, oh my god, that took so long. That took like 15 minutes to finally get to his bag. I remember that one being really annoying the first time I did this. Ugh, oh, okay. Oh, well, the moment I got to his back, I kind of had it in the bag. I mean, I just didn't want to fall because that would have really sucked.
Okay, this one's one of the tallest colossi in the game. So we're only in the third one. The second one was definitely annoying because you had to hit his feet to climb. Okay, so I'm trying to remember where the third one was. I gotta. Uh... Okay, so. Before we do that, I think up here, Yeah, the fruit actually give you more stamina. The lizards, I believe, give you more HP. Okay. So when we head to another shrine, that's where the lizards are going to be. The fruits usually are in like trees. Ah, keep doing that. Be going here quite a bit. Yeah, I gotta hold it. Okay, so there's a shrine over here. We're going to go to it right now. There's quite a bit of them in the game.
You can actually see where you're going. Whoops. There's usually a lizard here, but... <laughs> They're kind of hard to find. jump yeah all right that's where we need to go yeah there's another shrine over there some of them have the lizards some of them don't They all look the same. Oh, there it is. Is it? <laughs> Have to chase this fucking thing. It was right there, man.
Okay. Ugh. Oh, that took forever. Okay. Close. Yeah. Yeah. That was another lizard. I could have sworn I'm going the right way. Yeah, there's another lizard. Probably should have stopped and got that. Is this? I know I'm going the right way, right? Is it over here, maybe? It's saying it's over here. Unless it's yeah. over here. saying it's over here. Yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm only doing five colossi in this in this video. So I've already done two. This is gonna be number three coming up here. I think what I'm gonna do is No, I'm gonna need my I'm gonna need my horse.
Better get these while I'm here. Had similar color like the ones in the shrine ones. Yeah. All right. This has to be like. Even though I thought this was the wrong way, way, but no, this is the only way. I heard another one. All right, I'm just gonna move on here. Okay, it's over here. Gotta be almost there now, jeez. Okay, this should be it. Yep, finally. Ah, oh. it's a little confusing to get here. <laughs> Finally getting on our horse. Oh, man, I was close. Almost ran out of stamina there. I didn't want to fall, that's for sure. Okay, so this colossi, colossi is very big. It's kind of a pretty challenging one to get on, for, for sure. What you actually have to do here is hit this, this platform to destroy his, well, damage his sword and get on his arm. Okay, let me... I mean, you save here.
right here. There's no way to get on his arm. There's a way to get it across. I just can't fucking see. This is not how you're supposed to do it. Let me get let me get off. You're supposed to actually destroy his sword. And then you can get on. Okay. Alright, let's see if that's far enough. There we go. Now I can get on a sword. Alright, we gotta do that again. We can climb on his arm. gonna shake a lot. Okay. Right, so new we need to find a way to get to his stomach. platform on his stomach. Oh man. I got lucky there. We should be good. Got him. All right. I messed up the first time. 
But you have to destroy the sword in order to climb up. It's not too hard after that. I do like how a lot of these colossi are all unique to try to get on them. It took a while to even... Try to get here. Fourth one. This fourth one is um interesting. It's like a horse. See where this is at. Over here. Yeah. So it's a completely different location. how good this game looks, man. Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about the lizards right now. Oh, we found it already. How about that? That was quick. Compared to the last one, this one was a lot easier to find. <laughs> I'm glad this game got remade because it needed to be because this looks so good even on the original ps2 the game still looked pretty good but the frame rate was rough originally all right so this one you have to go inside these like little this is like a puzzle boss all of them are puzzles but so there it is right there You have to get on those things on its like neck or his mouth or whatever. Those like chains. I think it's one vital spot. Okay, so what we need to do is go right in here. We don't need aggro for this. And 
need to draw its attention. Sometimes it could take a long time for this thing to react. So it's trying to turn around here. Alright, come on, turn around. That's actually the more harder part of the whole thing. Is once I climb to these, then I should be good. But this thing does shake a lot. This thing shakes a lot. to get this thing to respond. I don't know where it's going. Follow me. This is gonna take a while to, cause this guy's supposed to go over here. It's actually a girl, but. Well, that's what I'm trying to do. Very difficult. I knew this thing was going to take a long time. You can climb it. The hardest part is just to get on him. It's just fucking respond, man. You're supposed to go over here and actually climb his chains, but he doesn't want to move.
to reach his back. That's what I'm trying to do. It's very, very annoying. No one doing this all wrong. I need to find a way to get him over here. taking too long. It's gonna be very annoying for this thing to constantly tell me about this shit. Ah. It's supposed to be simple, but of course it's not. It says to get to his back, but you can't climb his back until I knock him down. I can't believe how long this is taking. Constantly spinning. He needs to follow me, man. I'm gonna have to like look up and remember how to fucking do this shit. Cause I know how to do it. It's just, it's just constantly spinning. It doesn't. It's not moving. Yeah, I'm gonna be stuck in this for an hour, dude. Is it supposed to...
All right, finally. Holy shit. Holy shit, that took so long. Shades a lot. Oh, I'm not hitting the nose. Oh, that's his vital spot. No, do not fall. My God, thank God it's over. Jeez, man. So there's two ways to really climb on him, the back or the front. But that back part took forever. Yeah, you had to actually confuse him in order to go back and then he'll look down and then think it's, I'm there, but I'm not. That might have almost took 30 minutes to figure that out. At least 25 minutes. All right, one more to go for this stream. I'm not doing too bad. I mean, I'm doing this under two hours, but I know the next one's pretty, it's not as confusing. Do one more for this stream. So we got a first sky Colossus, Colossi. This one's pretty tough to get on. He, I think he has three vital spots. All right. I do that.
in the right spot. This is it. This one is going to be tricky to actually get. This is our first sky one. It's not the last, but it's definitely the first. This would be a nice way to end part one, that's for sure. This might take a couple of trips to climb this guy. Can climb his tail. If you get behind him, you can. So I gotta jump immediately and grab. That was the wrong, wrong spot. That was the wrong spot. This is not a good good way to grab him. Oh shit. Yeah, he'll he'll tend to do a barrel roll as well. Oh shit. Wow, I can't believe I grabbed onto that. You gotta hold on tight. Oh shit. Oh my god. I don't know how I'm getting so lucky holding on to him.
Oh shit! Well, now we gotta get to a tail. This tail is the other vital spot. I was really surprised I was able to hold on that long. All right, might be a minute till I actually get to him again. What's up, Tim? Good to see you. So I just noticed you on the stream. All right, where is he? He thinks I'm still on him. I have to draw his attention again. Wait till he comes around. So the only thing I gotta do is hit his tail. Okay, I draw his attention again. What the fuck? I jumped. What the fuck? Wow, he actually almost killed me. be a minute until I get back on. I have to get to his tail. His tail is actually not too bad. He doesn't shake too much on his tail. At least I'll get all my health back here. Luckily your health regenerates even if you mess up. Here we go again. <laughs> Gotta jump. The fuck? Dude, I'm jumping. I'm jumping the moment that wave is coming at me. I don't know why I'm not... I'm not grabbing him. That's so weird. I'm jumping as he's coming after me, but it's not react. It's not. I'm jumping and grabbing at the same time. Come on, man. It shouldn't be that hard to climb on him. Once I get on him, then I'll be good. Come on down. I knew this was going to take a while. When I edit these, I usually cut all the shit out, but... I was really surprised I was able to hang on as long as I did. The first time. Alright, at least all my health is back now.
I gotta find a way to jump. There! Finally! Now I gotta get to his tail. Fuck. Come on. Oh my god! Seriously? Seriously. That's bullshit. I knew this was going to be annoying. Oh, yeah, this is going to take so long to beat this. Did I get him? All right, now I got him. Gotta get to his tail. That's where his final vital spot is. Damn it, I don't want him to fucking roll. Alright, I gotta be careful here. Finally! Oh my god. That took way too long to finally get to his tail. If I didn't fall down the first time, I probably would have beat this like less than five minutes. Alright, well that's finally done. That was annoying. coming towards me now. Can't outrun it. So the fruit increases my HP. Okay. I thought it was the other way around. Well, yeah, I haven't played this game in, like, almost, it's been a well over 10 years, so I'm just trying to remember as I'm going. If I held on the first time without the wings and the stamina going out, I probably would be able to beat that pretty fast. The tail is actually the easiest part. Oh, this one. This one's a fucking pain in the ass. Uh, but I'm going to do that next time. I'm not doing that right now. Hm. I think this one is... Uh... Hold on, I'm going to go ahead and... I'm trying to remember what the sixth one was. Yeah, I like the second um, flying one. That's number 13. It's pretty good. Oh, 
Alright guys, so this is going to be it for part one of Shadow of the Colossus. I do want to thank uh, PJ and of course Tim. Welcome to the stream. And uh, This is not a very long game. It's very short. It's very, very short. But I'm enjoying myself. I know that I raged a little bit in the last part, but this is going to be it. I'm going to leave it as it is. Um, both Flying Colossi make an appearance in the movie... Oh, really? Okay. Well, that's going to do it, guys. So I'm going to stream tomorrow a little bit on the early side. This was the premiered stream of the playthrough. And so I'm going to do five more Colossi, and then five more again, and then wrap up the game in part four. So there's only going to be like four parts of this. So I look forward to it. Um, tune in next time for more. So, all right, guys. I will see you guys later. Peace.